Sports scientists work with athletes and coaches to test, analyse and evaluate training and also to implement training programmes. I'm Phil Heritage and I'm the course lead on the Bachelor of Science for Sports, Exercise and Health Sciences at AECC University College. The main three pillars are physiology, which also includes nutrition, biomechanics, which is about the movement of the body, and psychology, which is around the brain, but also uh, how neurochemicals work and also how environmental things can have an impact on things like our attention and stress. Being a sports scientist is great if you want to be involved in professional sport, but you also you can travel the world, work with some really high profile people, but also you get to experience that feeling of being in a stadium full of people, there's nothing like it. So most students will come to us with an A-level in a science subject, ideally something like biology, but we'd also accept physical education because we know that the underpinning science of that is physiology, some psychology and biomechanics, uh, and also BTEC in, in sports studies as well. And then students will go on to study a Bachelor of Science and that then gives you the qualifications you need to go on and become a sports scientist. And often, people will also get themselves a Master of Science as well in an associated area. I would tell someone who's thinking of becoming a sports scientist that if you love sport, you love being in a competitive arena and environment, if you uh, love working with athletes or working with other people, then it is the, the, the job to go into. It's hard work, you work long hours, there's no escaping that, but it is all worth it to be in that environment, in that moment, and especially when the people you're working with are successful. There, there is no feeling like it.